Fred, Fred is oblivious to what's happening unless I tell him. Exactly. Seriously, straight, straight up, bro. Fred does not know anything because because Craig don't call him. Craig stopped calling him when Part Thirteen got shut down. Exactly. So, contrary to what he told everybody at ABC, that is not that is not what happened. You know, so so Craig feels some kind of way toward toward Fred because Fred heard what I said and, and I gave him that email exposing him about what he did. So now he feels some kind of way about Fred. So he, here, here's the funny thing, when you had called me, I was listening to this nigga uh, on his, am I angry, am I mad at God, right? Yeah. In that video, this nigga said, when people decide to leave, they try to meet with them, they talk, you know, they, they, they hear what they have to say, they pray. Right. This is what this fool said, bro. But in your rant, you said, if you're gonna leave, just leave. Don't 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 come talking to me. Don't even come shake. Don't just buy. What what which one is it? You know, we have a policy even here at the church. You know, we clear everything before anyone leaves the church or you know, if they talk to us, you know, they leave in good standing. We don't have knockout, drag outs and fights and arguments and stuff like that at this church. We don't do that. We make sure the people that I've talked to that have left this church, I, I sit them down, we've talked, I say, hey, you know. A, B, C, D, E, and we're crying and help and getting them help, and we and they agree, and yeah, you know, uh, uh, I've been in there with my elders or my wife or whatever, and they agree with us, and this is the best thing I need to do, this I need to do, this, and everything's good, you you good, we're going to check on you, we're going to make sure you're good, whatever, whatever. I'm sick of looking in your face. I'm ready for you to go, because you obviously don't understand spiritual warfare because you're trying to think your way through something, and it takes the spirit of God to fight in the spirit rick. Some of you ain't been saved since you've been here. That's why you have an appetite for that. Amen. Have I lied yet? That's the way it's going to be, man. No, don't, don't shake my hand. Don't shake it if I'm not your leader. If I'm not your pastor, don't shake my hand. All these churches out here and you acting like somebody holding you here hostage. Take your witchcraft and go somewhere else. And I ain't talking to you either. What I got to talk to you about? Because here's the thing. What he said Friday in that in that in that video, and my man at God, is not what he really means by what he said on Sunday. Because what he said Sunday came out of his heart. That's what, how he feel. Oh yeah, cause oh trust me, straight up with all that we, like I said, me and Jazz, my first hand that that nigga lying about that. Cause even cause when cause when Jazz, how Jazz left. When, when Jazz did, when he made the decision, he told me I was the only person he told. Right. And he sent the email over to he sent the email over to Craig. Yep. Yeah, he told me the too. Su the Sunday I walked in there, Seiko, I promise you every nigga up in there knew Jazz said level. What? Cause Man. right after it happened, I'm still on the media team. Yeah. Head to head of the media team to call me. I don't know if we all I'm up in there smirking because I'm like, nigga, I already know what this is. Thank you, bro. This nigga here, man. That nigga foul, dog. He is foul, right. yo. Oh, yeah, and everything killed me. And then even after that, other brothers in there trying to go around it. But I know while we talking, I can see it in the eyes. You want to ask me about it. Uh. Like, bro, you're not fooling, you're not fooling anybody. Wow. Hold on, hold on one second. Hold on, this Jarrett. Right. Hold on, this Jarrett right here. Hold on, hold on one second. Let me, let me pass you through. Hold on. No, hey, Jarrett. Hey, Mr. Woods, how you doing? Hey, man. Hey, I got, I got your boy on the line, bro. What up, boy? Yeah. What's up, bro? What's up, man? Yeah. Hey, Drake. Drake, tell him you're gonna kill him. Tell him you're gonna kill him with part three, bro. Bro. Oh, oh my that's God. the one. That's the straight. Hey, that's the favorite DVD. One he will always reference back in the day. Say, like, oh, you have a field day with that nigga on that one. Yeah. Oh, field day. Oh, oh my right. God. All the DVDs. <laughs> this is the one. So, oh, I, 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 out of all the DVDs, this is the one. Yeah. 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 You're going to be licking your chops after you watch that DVD. Like, oh, I got this nigga. Ooh, nigga. I got this nigga. Nigga. Look, put it like this. I just killed all your hard work, bro. I just killed it. You, 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 give, me the, you give me the minute marks, dog. You give me the minute marks, dog. 
Bro, it's over, bro. Huh? I gave you a summary of everything. Man. I'm watching it right now. Yes, sir. I'm watching it right now. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. If oh. you do this, you, this is the one where you want to watch through both this. Just okay. watch through them. Okay. You're going to laugh. Okay. The levels of how pop this is. Yeah, yeah. You've been getting in before. Like, this is going to take you over the edge. This one, you just might even play certain parts from the DVD, bro. You just might even play. Like, wow. I'm getting ideas for music just off the DVD. Ooh. <laughs> that's that shit. That's that shit, bro. That's that work. This that work right here. Nigga, so, nigga, nigga, I can have a watch party and just run a DVD, huh? Yup. Yeah. Exactly. Real talk. Oh, bro. Real talk. So, this, 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 that, that's his favorite DVD, man. He said it many times that was his favorite DVD. Ooh. It was all favorite DVD. Nigga. And then he titled it Danny Craig Superstar. That's the name of our three. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a two it's a that, two-part DVD, but it's part three. It's part three, yeah. Yep. Oh my gosh. Dude, you gonna have a fucking field day. Oh, I can't wait for that. You gonna wait for that? Hey, hey, my wife stopped me. Like, hey, I just turned on the thing. First, like, just the intro. I was like, that's gonna kill him. I stopped it. That's what I'm saying. Oh, <laughs> he just bro. started. He ain't even start preaching yet. Bro, it's like, like this man wrote. It's over, it goes, man. All you gotta do is throw a little dot on him. With that, he just wrote his own obituary. That's it. Yep. That's it. That's it, bro. That's, that's it. it. Old. Trust me, that's why they knew when Jazz left, they already knew. They started looking at me like I was public enemy number one. Wow. <laughs> oh, no, nah, Fago, oh, they already knew. Tell them about it. Fago, I got dragged, because I told you about the first one, Fago, I got dragged into two memes because this nigga left. What? <laughs> I got dragged into two memes because this nigga left. <laughs> wow. And I promise you, the first one, I promise you, they had everybody else there, but that meeting really was for me. Yeah. Got you, got you. Ed, Ed, the main dude on the media team, he got the blessing from Craig to do the little first little meeting. He was like, I need to know where all of y'all stand, all this. Like, okay, whatever, nigga. Wow. <laughs> then, the next, then, like, the Sunday or so after that, I get pulled into the office again, get called to the principal's office again. By myself. By myself, with Ed and Julian. And the only reason the altercation didn't pop off is because Ed kept his mouth shut about how disrespectful he was with a message he sent to Jazz. So, so like, I already got him with you, bro. You speak is already known. Wow. So you and, and this is how I know all of them watching your all of them watching your videos, psycho. Because when Julian when Julian was talking to me, he came in and just kinda of weird, you know, Jazz left and I know your relationship with, you know, with Jazz and with Ariel. Mm -hmm. So as I heard her name, I'm like, we ain't having me talking God knows how long. Yeah. But I know she I see she be posting on your psycho videos. Y'all niggas watching. Wow. Yeah. I am like, no, nigga, popping. I'm like, eh. Like a hawk. I mean, they still telling on themselves, bro. Right. I mean, just let them niggas talk, bro. They're telling themselves, bro. They're down their own self out. Just let them talk. And the whole time, I'm just listening to them talk. Yeah. I'm just like, okay, I'm like, okay, why am I here? We just want to make sure you're good. I'm like, damn, the grown man. I am too. You don't affect my decision. Right. Why am I in here? Can I go? <laughs> and you know, and you know that nigga, that nigga Craig is rock because that nigga. How you talking about you don't know me, but you ranting about a nigga you don't know? That yeah. you ain't never seen? Mm -hmm. That you ain't never seen before? Nigga, you a lie. You have seen me, nigga. And, right. He was with me when he, when he, when he, when he, when he, when he was up front. Say, we went there was in the front row. We always said in the front row. Oh, oh my God. So this nigga can't lie. There was a leaf over next to his son, man. For real. That's how well known we are. Uh, I was cool with Landon. I used to work out with Landon. We were crying and stuff together. So it's like, I know. Nigga, I'm. Wow. And that's the thing. Other, other men trying to play stupid. It was over 100 men up in there. All of us heard you say that, nigga. What? Yeah. yeah. It was over 100 men when you said that story. All of us heard you say it. Wow. And you wanted to keep our wives offline. But you don't know the nigga, and but you warning us about it. Yeah. Man, come on, bro. See what I'm saying? The spirit of the thing. The spirit of the thing, bro.
Nah, nah, Jeff. He graduated. He a demon. Yeah, he a demon. He's a graduate. Whoa. I got you used to that, Dre. I got you used to that. I got you used to that. Like, man, one day, this nigga ain't mad for what he called me a demon. I mean, he should have spent the thing since. Yeah, for real. Yeah. That's another demon thing. New demon name. Yeah. I was recording that day when that nigga said that line. Yeah. Oh yeah. That wasn't even that wasn't even the funniest part. Him crying and lying about that. I was on camera. They would have said my face. I'm like, he's lying. Oh wow. So you so you was there during that time too? Yeah, this is the same. I was there when Will Ford showed up. I was there. I oh was there basically. The last service I was there, the last Sunday I was there was the Sunday after Christmas. Are you serious, bro? That was the last time I was there. So I got to see all this foolishness firsthand. So and the whole time I'm there, I'm just like, I'm seeing it. And I, and I know not God can hand me up for a reason. Exactly. Like, I want you to stay here a little bit long and see the foolishness. Come on, I want bro. You to see why you really need it. Come on, come on, yeah. come on. And he, he did I, you like I, Ezekiel. He did you like Ezekiel. He took you behind the wall. Yeah, let me let me let me, yeah. let, me, let, me, let, me look, look at this hole in the wall and see all this filth and all this yeah. foolishness. No, and the, and the first time I saw it, because it was after the conversation me and Jerry had, when Jerry yeah. told me, it's like, Jerry, it's like, Jerry, you're going to see all of it because I know you. Yo, just remove all emotion from this whole situation and just go in with just logic and just look at everything. Man. And that was the son that he started explaining why he, he picked Ken as an elder. <laughs> and then when Ken came up and started preaching, that's, I started shaking my head like five minutes after Ken started talking. I'm like, y'all niggas guilty, y'all shit. Sure. Sure. So wait a minute, so, 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 that's, so wait a minute, is that the one where he, he did our joke? Is that is that I, is that the Ken that was that had, had a constant preaching out of Job? Was that is that him or was that somebody else? Uh, I believe so. Because like after after he did after Craig did his little after Craig did his little introduction, right, for him, right, and Ken started talking and getting and he, and that's what shocked me because Ken ain't for all the Ken he's usually red even kid. Yeah. But I, he was angry, and you could see it, I'm like, yeah. He, he like, was trying to hardly recognize him. No, and he, he was trying to act tough. It's like, dude, I grew up in the hood. That's the one thing I know for a straight. I know when somebody's trying to act like they are. Yeah. When they really scared. Y'all niggas should. Yo, that's what's all the me. Shaco, I'm like, Shaco, catch y'all. Yeah, but we never seen that fool that shit. Oh, wait, oh, this oh, is oh, I was like, oh, this nigga shit. This is the one he's talking about when they were kids. Uh, well, you recorded that one. That was the one when you had that recording it was just all black? Yeah! Boy, that scared the crap out. You were scared, huh? Don't be scared. Uh-uh, don't be scared and don't laugh either, because it ain't funny. Oh, Are you serious? <laughs> oh, man, bro. I was like, man, where that fool at? <laughs> Are you serious, bro? And, and, and take this, this is the thing, too. Uh, the time I was there in that building while I was there that could cut the tension with a knife. Are you freaking and serious, bro? Because Craig knew and everybody sitting down. Craig knew that all of us was watching the video. And, yeah. and people could say what they want. Oh, he wouldn't dare do that. Nigga, you know he watching them, too. He oh, yeah. Was. Oh, yeah. That nigga the only thing was. is, you ain't man enough to admit what's going on. Right. And I, I want y'all to understand this who your pastor is. I have never Googled my name before. Ever. I don't know what people are saying about me. Not at all. If I did that, that would drive me crazy. So I have no clue what's going on. Ever. I've never watched it old, new, anything where somebody is using a platform to try to hinder EX Ministries, I have never set my eyes or ears on it. Ever. But you ain't got to bring me nothing. Because I'm not going to watch it. Well, well, we know and everybody's acting different. The leadership just more tight and ain't as much joking. Mm -hmm. Then I finished the word. After the dad left, Craig only spoke to me one time after that. The oh, yes, yes. I'm about to hit a security sitting next to you, Drake. Oh, Clemente, this is spooky, nigga. Come on, bro. Yeah, man, that nigga trash, bro. Go anytime, ahead, speak on that nigga, bro. Anytime, 
speak on that. Because there was a time, there was a time after you shook him where we stopped recording. Uh huh. We, we stopped recording everything. So I'm sitting with my wife because me and my wife sit in the same area every time. Now you look for me say it's on the back wall. Uh huh. But every Sunday, this man is getting closer. <laughs> he getting closer. He getting closer, closer to us. Uh huh. The last Sunday we was there, this nigga right on me. I'm like, nigga, do you want to put on my wife? Are you serious, <laughs> dog? <laughs> no, and Craig wouldn't. And it's the thing, Craig wouldn't speak to me. The only, the last time he spoke to me was when we was in a booth. It was basically me, his son, and a couple other brothers. Yeah. And it wasn't really like he was speaking directly to me. He was speaking in the group. Bruh, let me tell you something. He wouldn't, he wouldn't, he wouldn't speak to me. He wouldn't even, say, wouldn't even say hi to my wife. Oh, that nigga, he was mad, bro. He was, he was a big man. Hey, he was old. Nah, it wasn't just drove. He think it, it's like, hold up. He know I ain't staying here long. I, if I'm staying here, he think I might do something to him. That's right. probably what he thought. Right. I ain't tell him he might do me something. Right. No, he ain't doing nothing. Say no doing it. Then I'm tired of You know what I mean? That's it. I'm going to be bro. I don't care. That's you. That's you all I need to know. What I'm going to do? Dang, you popcorn. You need some popcorn. Yeah, I'm just watching this. Wow, wow, wow. Hold, hold on. And then the fact. Hold on one second. Give me one second. Hold on one second. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. That was true. Oh, yeah, this is all. I think talking about the wheel. Wait, wait, talking about the wheel for us, though. That's hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I was just about to hit you back up, Dre. I did it. I knew you was on the on the on phone with Taylor. Now because I hit him up and let him know that yeah, man, I hit I hit him up to let him know what happened. Yeah. Well, yeah, you know Taylor got the talk. Bro, yeah, bro. Yeah, I'm about to I'm about to I'm sending Taylor this uh, shoot down hip hop three four. I'm getting the okay, I'm okay. I'm gonna annihilate you, bro. Bro, you're gonna annihilate <laughs> <laughs> liberation. Yeah. That's that's what that is. Now, that's, that's, that's that's what, the funny thing about all of this, bro, is that. I haven't even. I was telling. I was talking to. Uh, I was talking to uh, Kumite's wife, Kelly, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. And so she was like, "This." She said the same thing y'all had said a while back. That yeah, you 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 you're rocking this dude because she said he's never ever responded to anybody on social media the way he's responding yeah. now. Even though he he refused yeah. to mention. Even though he refused to mention your name, everybody yeah. knows. Who you are? Well, everybody. 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 Because, because anytime somebody would come at him, that's when you know it's a red flag. Because you were always joking about. Oh no, it. It ain't no real threat. Oh no, let me tell you. When, when Eddie texts me, the first thing, the first thing he sent in a text about me going to hell is, is that when I get involved with Seiko Woods, don't get involved with Seiko Woods. But Craig don't know. He don't know who you are. He don't know you by name. But, but you your top visual, your, your top, your, your top team do though. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And we were all, all together when Craig told us all at one time who you were. So your yeah, visual dude my... know your top deacon and one of your head assistants know about it. So you pull me into a meeting, ask me about stuff. Like, dude, stop playing, dude. You're buying. Wow. wow. You trying to, you still trying to seem strong when everybody knows. Come yeah. on, bro. We know. We like, know, bro. We know. Because you have to have a lot to do that because they got a lot of kids when we're doing our camera work. They got a lot of kids sleeping and stuff like that. We almost had that in the shop. What? And I'm like, nigga, I do a lot of hard in the shop. Y'all only see like maybe one or two kids sleeping in there. Yeah, they're going to be sleeping. Why they acting like that? It's like, I'm like, they're babies. They're like one and a half. People, look, newborns. Of course they're going to be sleeping. What you talking about? So he told y'all to dim the light. He said he's going to dim the light. Yeah. Yeah. Cause niggas leave. Yeah, 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 but then when I was there when he talked about the life, a lot of people sick, niggas sick of you. Wow. Yeah. This nigga <laughs> The peak the peak of comedy though is when you had Will Ford though. Oh yeah. Tell him. Tell him. That was peak of comedy. What? Real Ford, I give it to him. I don't know how much he, I don't know how much George must have paid him or he got some dirt on him too. Yeah, he paid him. But Will walked up in there, did did his thing. Honestly, the, the only thing close to sound preaching any of us had heard in years. Yeah. Yeah. Because he's actually going through the Bible, uh -huh. actually going through it, uh -huh. line to line. So that was refreshing. Okay. Yeah. So he does his thing. Then all of a sudden, he like this is gone. He like we just need we just need to pray right now. We just need to pray. We on we on camera. I'm on camera, mind you. 
Yeah. Julian, one of the head dudes, the camera talking about, yeah, everybody get down and fight, even us. He's like, nigga, what are you talking about? What? <laughs> <laughs> is this the time for pray? This is going to be a season of forgiveness. No, it ain't, nigga. Are you serious, bro? Yeah. I didn't yeah. do anything. <laughs> Anything to where a man is dropping dropping videos every week about my stupidity. <laughs> Why I got a place with you? Oh wow, bro. Trust me, I was on there praying. I was talking to the Lord like, Lord, I I know you have me here for a reason to see this, but this is a lot right now. This is the dumbest <laughs> thing I've ever seen. This is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Oh. It's like, don't worry, just just stay, just stay. It's right. ain't gonna be too much longer. I need you to remember it though. So, so what was it? So what did it for you, then, Dre? What I mean, what what was the what was the, the you know the last you know the, the the last straw? What was the you know the strong the two the breaking off? points? Yeah, the yeah. The two breaking points for me. Well, two things. Because okay. before, because I never thought this. Because before, 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 he didn't register to me like you said you're a military man. Most of most of the men in my family are in the military. Yeah. So first rule of combat, know yeah. your enemy. Know your enemy. You yeah. telling me this dude coming at me, but you telling me don't look at it, don't tell my family, and this dude attacking us? Nah, oh. that, don't, that don't that don't sit right with me. Right. So I'm just looking at common stuff like that and seeing how the vibe changing at, at church. But when you drop that Marilyn Monroe set. <laughs> I was like, you know what? Some told me, the Lord was like, it ain't long, it ain't like an hour and a half, and they're like, that's great. No. Okay, click. The second I heard that nigga voice, wow. <laughs> they go, I ain't been that angry in a long time. Yeah. I ain't been that angry in a long time because it's like, I know this nigga voice. Can't nobody tell me this ain't his voice. I didn't have private conversations with you and your son. I heard you preach for years. I recorded you instantly. I recorded. I recorded your sermons. I recorded DVDs you sold. I know your voice. Wow, yep. nigga, I know. And then a few Sundays later, when he came up there and he was like, the whole situation. I'm, I'm not really gonna get into it. And if you can't accept that, you got a problem there. Oh well. Yeah, that's what did it. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, uh, what was it? They, they, he, was, he was talking about the accusation. When people was buzzing about the accusation or something like that. What, what, why? Yeah, it's like, look, I'm not gonna get into this situation. Uh, if you don't, you don't, uh, you don't like the fact that I'm not gonna talk about anything like that. Oh well. Mm -hmm. Nigga, what? Wow. I've been here seven years, donating, giving my time. I help, I help you fix up this building. Wow. I, I, record, I recorded and not charged you anything. Like, Dude. the least you owe me is an explanation. Come on, bro. Yeah. That's the yeah. least you owe me. Yeah. <sighs> that nigga just cracked me, man. He is and this, this is the, the funny thing about it, Sago. I ain't gonna lie, the Lord, and let me get a couple blessings out of it, too, because I got a better job out of the movie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I did get a better job out of it, and a couple of the brothers work over there, but. Law was even working in. I yeah. wanted to get one of the departments where they were at. He put me in a department where none of them was at. They ain't got no control over me. That's what's up. So when one of them, one of the brothers came over to me because he saw me, he knew I had been at service. Came with the usual spirit. They're like, yeah, man, I ain't seen you at service, man. Did somebody offend you? You didn't do it? He was like, well, you want me to be honest? Mm. I ain't bringing my family up in there. This dude ain't being real. I ain't bringing my wife up in there. I'm just, I'm bringing, I'm bringing what's most important to me and most valuable into this building. If you're not being real to tell me and let me tell me the information so I can make a real decision as a man or what I want to do. And if I want to stay, I'll go. Yeah. And I told him straight up, I used the line Craig said he was talking about the example problem with it. Oh, well, I told him, look at that advice. I have a problem with it. Right. Oh. And I already knew he was going to go back and tell George, I have a problem with it. Right. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, George, 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 like the outside of the inner circle. Man, yeah. when he told me, when, man, was like two and a half hours one one Saturday morning, bro. When that brother told me how they treated him and his family, bro, I was in tears. 
I was in that, and that man was on the phone crying to me, bro. And I just broke down with. I was like, I said, man, if, bro, that that his story. Listen, his story and uh, Vera, uh, uh, Vrijay's story, bro, broke me. Yeah. To the point that was yeah. I said, man, I'm taking that nigga head off, bro. That, that's why I'm yeah. not, bro. That's one of the reasons why I don't stop. Bro. Them two people, bro, right there. Man, I said this yeah. nigga, this nigga, this nigga's a terrorist, bro. I'm taking this nigga out. I don't give a crap. No. Nobody say, bro. Yeah, 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 bro. After that man little more effect, that's when I went back and watched everything else. Wow. And I watched the Lila video. My wife literally pointed that nigga out to me in church too. Yeah. Yeah. Pointed that nigga out to me, and I'm like, I done talked to this nigga before, and this nigga done beat on this woman, Bruh. and she's sitting up in here laughing and kicking, bro. Beat on that woman, bro. It's like, bro, I'm, I'm literally like shaking when she pointed to him, cause I'm like, I wanna get up and like, yeah, and just punch him in his jaw right now, like, yeah, like yeah. why yeah. are you here? Exactly, sitting right up in the, sitting right up in that piece, bro. And you put her yeah, out. And you put her out. You put her out though. You put, he put, he put, he put, he put uh, what's the name of uh, uh, Ariel out? He put her out. Put out, you know, I mean, dude, this, this nigga kicking fuck out. Yeah. And, then, and you want to talk about church discipline, nigga? Nigga, you want to no, talk about mass communication, nigga? And come on, bro. Yeah. And that's the thing that got me, because we, of course, we know her. Yeah. So when she was referencing the dude that, like, told off, that was me. Yeah, man. Yeah. I apologize about that. I need to talk and apologize about that because my thing is, I thought I'm coming from the mindset that George already told her all this, that she knew this. Right. Then when I hear that, I'm like, this nigga ain't told her nothing. Yeah, man. Ain't told her how things supposed to go. I'm like, I yelled at her for no reason. Right. I got, I got on her for no reason. I'm like, this, I, I'm basically doing this nigga job. Yep. 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 Like, yeah, like, and he talking about he, like you said, like, oh, this nigga is a terrorist. Like, yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah. He is, bro. Yeah. And, that, and that's he why is, I, I don't show niggas like him no mercy, bro. So people talk, hey, you prayed for him. Man, ain't, ain't, ain't trying to pray, it's time to lay for real. And, and when, when I, I even talk about that, that preacher message like that, and then you gonna turn around and do the dirty do. Right. Man, bro, that's great. Right. No praying no more, bro. None. He ain't no praying. None. None. This, no. And say, no, this is how I know this nigga mentally is. Because me and Jared were talking about this like the day before yesterday. Yeah. I was like, to do the things you do, but yet you teach men to be confrontational. Mm. Yeah. That you encourage men. Man. You encourage men to have several firearms. You've had lessons at your, at your building where people could get registered, be registered to open yep. carry. Yep. And you come in after that and come and sleep with the women and marry them off and see what they want? That's it, bro. Nigga, how stupid are you? Bro, that nigga demonic, bro. You know everybody up in here acting. Yep. You know. Yep. Stupid, bro. Yep. The slaughterhouse, man. Every man up in here is packing. At least one piss, bro. And this ain't the husbands in there don't know yet. Bro. Oh, forget that. I ain't there. I'm gonna be watching on the news when it finally go down. Yep. I was just there. <laughs> man. <laughs> bro. And I'm telling you, bro. man, I, when I when I tell you, bro, I still got folk coming forward. When I had when I had put out part five, uh 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 what was that what was that four? No, no, four. That was four. Yeah, when I put out four over the weekend, bro. More women oh, came forward. Yeah, more women came forward, bro. More women came forward. Man. More. Done. More. Done. Four? More women. More women came forward, bro. Look, I, I know what Demona oh, is, bro. I know what Demona at now. I got her number, bro. Man. Yes. Done. I, I, just haven't, I just haven't called her. I got her number, bro. I know, I know, I, I actually got her number. And I'm like, I'm just gonna sit on it. I'm just gonna sit on it. I'm gonna sit on that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I, yeah, bro, yeah. That, 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 that massage table, that's gonna be that nigga downfall, bro. That, right nigga, that nigga been moving that massage table around like furniture, bro. Man. The thing that killed me though is that like, him trying to act tough. That's the part that kind of makes me laugh. Yeah. I'm That's like, nigga, well, you know you would piss yourself if you saw any of us by yourself in the street. Yeah, nope. Exactly. You piss yourself because you uh, knew you were getting punched in the jaw. You, okay, no, no. you don't like Louisiana folks because uh, uh -huh. he always talked about this you know, little confrontation he had in New York when he was running his mouth. Like, you got to take the Louisiana fast when those boys trying to run up on. Mm. 
Wow. Even with how he was, even with how he was joke, joking, because I'm, I'm being single, you know, the, the punk stuff and all that. Yeah. He go hard on other people, but he didn't go as hard on me. Oh no, not Drake. Oh no, Drake right. was respected. He wow. respected him as a single man. Wow. Oh, yeah. No, and this was the Drake. thing. The one thing, because Jay didn't know it, it happened a couple times. There been even Jay, even Jay Byron. There been a few times. They then got out of pocket and they, they take the kindness for weakness. Yeah. Him, her, and they started finding stuff and I just look at them. Yeah. The stone face and then to the stop. Jay will just walk away. Me and Jay Bryan ain't never really been that cool. He just walk away. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, yeah. Like, I don't care where you're from, bro. We up in here, but don't, don't, don't get it twisted. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I ain't, no, I ain't. That's, why we, that's why we never was that tight. They, yeah. they, they, they're real cool with people that can, they can run over. Real right, tight. exactly. That's what's in the inner circle. They can run over each other if they want. That, and that's, if you notice, that's why when I dropped that I dropped that video on that nigga Jay Bryan over the weekend about 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 messy niggas, and I mentioned Jay and Jay Soul, nigga. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, bro, that I ain't hurts. heard nothing from that, that nigga. I ain't heard nothing from that nigga. Ain't said nothing to me now. Be careful who you share your secrets to, nigga. Everybody, you he'll pass the, he'll pass the telling you bitch. Thank you, nigga. Bro, they clowning you. Up here saying, well, yeah, you trying to be this nigga apprentice. I, I clown that nigga about his about this so called uh, album, that CD uh, Christian crap too. Yeah. You, yeah. How you how you got an album, but your but your pastor owned the rights to your music? What, what the death right. row and shit night going on here? You ain't you yeah, ain't you, you ain't doing you. nothing. Take it back even further to five heartbeat. Nigga, what? It, Thank it, you. It, it, what you what you going on? Like, bro, you ain't know the first thing you gotta own your own work. Thank you, nigga. Yeah. Your, your, ma master your, master. your master on your master. Your master on your master. Here come my. You gonna walk away with nothing? Nothing. But her shield is an empty pocket. Nothing. Yo. Nothing, nothing bro. You up here trying to get another man bitch. Handle your bitch. Bro. 90 percent, by I'm probably low balling. At least ninety percent of the people that was up in there when it was at Mac right. had musical yeah. talent. Musical talent. Jay ain't even Jay ain't even the top ten of best rap. He ain't even in the top ten of best rappers that's been in there. Wow. Nope. He ain't even in the top ten. No. Jeez. Nobody ain't get, nobody else good up there. No, not not bragging, but me and Jay can rap circles around this dude. Right, 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 yeah. right, right. We can rap circles around you. Yeah. But it's like he knows the pick. It's like he who got any kind of backbone is like I wanna deal with him. Right. Him. Yeah. He ain't gonna question me. Yeah. He know what's up. Yeah, he know what's up because I, I, yeah, I questioned my last crap. Right. And I left. That would lead to that exit. <laughs> yeah, cause real niggas, cause real niggas ain't gonna just sit back, man. Let you just play them, bro. Not no real niggas. Oh. Sorry. Oh. It ain't gonna happen like that, bro. I, I had a private talk with my last spouse, bro. We we talked it out like men and everything, and I left. That's just what it was. Right. Like, we ain't like he didn't give me that courtesy. That fool literally said that his his service countless times. Oh no, you ain't gonna have your moment where you can come tell me off. Oh no, nah, no, nah, just, just leave. Just leave. Wow. You got a problem with me? Just get up and leave. Okay. I don't want to know. He said, I don't want to know. Okay. I don't want to know. All right. That's what he said. Yeah, right. right. But, how many times? But he wanted to sit up there and go, oh, baby, we used to be able to talk. You used to be able to talk. What? Be where you don't want to talk. Why are you angry, man? You can't control the house and we don't want to talk. Right. And you broadcast that lie all the time. Wow. Which that's not on the two jerseys, but that's, oh. that's the part he cuts off. Of course. Of course. I ain't never kicked out of them. What today? Yeah. Right. <laughs> never kicked out of them. <laughs> what today? I'm like, I'm talking about don't they make me yeah, uh, take a break. I, that's, what, what does that mean, take a break? Take a break. Oh, take. No, 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 tell him, tell him how, 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 you, how, you, uh, how you put it, how you take a break, bro. He sit down. He sit down in service in the front row. No. Still a cop. He just sit down. And he still gives the introduction. Yeah. Oh, nigga. But he just don't tap. I'm taking a break. I just need to go after a long series. I just take a break. Nigga. That ain't what we talking about. Right. Why is that repentance? Right. Why is that repentance? Cut off the water. Cut off the lights. Close the doors. Thank go you. home. Exactly. That's what we're saying. Exactly. And don't come back, nigga. Don't come don't back. back. How is it that this nigga got, got everybody... You know, and I'm not jabbing nobody because you know, this, this, at the time people just thought that they was doing it for the for the kingdom. This nigga got yeah. state of the art stuff in that building, but he Real don't though. he ain't owning the building. You renting the building, nigga? Just renting the building. 
Somebody just rent the building. That's the that's nigga at his spot. You ain't that's buying no is. property. You ain't, no, you ain't buying no land, nigga. All that money, you could have bought a piece of land. Now, it, look, yeah. two acres would be enough. Man, two acres? That's enough yeah. land for a church for that size? Because you're in a strip yeah. center right now. You're in a strip center. So what you doing, bro? All that money going straight to G. Craig, man. All of it. Oh, you got a hood up the street, you probably had a hood up on the corner from there. Man. No, no, it's in the, it's in the same parking lot. They, they know it. They probably know. They probably know. He like, he don't go there for the girl, so he love the wings, man. Oh, that's what he is. He yeah. love the wings, okay. Yeah. yeah, so he love the wings. Uh-huh. Yeah, he didn't find uh -huh. yeah, just like everybody else. Right, yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. I, 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 so I, I, that's why I know for a fact, man, this nigga yeah. refuses to challenge me or to respond face to me. I'm like, nigga, what, let, let's nigga cam up. Let's go. You, yeah, man. You know, no, I, yeah. I don't. I don't do that. Y'all know I don't do that. Oh, liar. Oh, bro, that's cool. Liar. Liar. No, there's a, there's a, there's a, there's a, no, he was laughing. No, he was laughing at that for hours. Here's an example why I know he's lying. Several times when Kurt Franklin came at you and two shots, he done whole services on this nigga. Thank you. Whole service. Stop. Thank you, bro. You done whole services on him. Him, Keaton, Jake, anytime somebody threw a subtle jab at you, you rip ran the go to come back down, yo. But now, oh, I didn't see that same confidence with you walking around with your head held up. Yeah. Man, you, you okay. No, no, no. We see all the blood on, all the blood on the floor, but he was sitting like that. Right. Hey, George, you leaking. You leaking, bro. You leaking. Your, 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 your mouth. I'm fine. Nigga, check your mouth, bro. Your mouth is looking, bro. Your mouth blown right. out, bro. Your mouth like blown you, out. Hey, I got the towel right here, George. You want to throw it in? Bro, get the smelling oh. salt. Get the smelling salts. Smelling up, bro. What day? What day is it, George? What day is it? What day is it? How many fingers I got up, George? How many fingers? No, don't, don't, don't nobody tap the back of his head. Nobody, no. Everybody, let me see your hand. No, George. How many fingers I got up? Look at me. Look at me, George. Don't look at the old hand, George. Don't look at the old hand. Yeah. 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 Nigga. I'm like, bro. Oh. Man, I'm like, this nigga. That, man, when that when that nigga did uh, that, pull that stunt. Uh, and told people there's some there's just some guy on social media, uh, you know, yeah. just uh, you know he's mad. This ain't this ain't even about Kanye. He just mad because I didn't you know I didn't let him come to lunch with me and Fred. And so this was all this. Is, man, that nigga said that, bro. I, man, I remember where I was, nigga. I was at Whole Foods, nigga, in the parking lot, and I went live on that nigga. I said, nigga, you a lot, nigga. You know exactly who I am, nigga. Yeah. That's what killed me when he said it. Oh, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna go to lunch with him. He doing all this over, over you on a lunch date? Come on, bro. Over a lunch date. Really? 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 No, I gotta be deeper than that. I'm like, nigga, this is 2019. At the time I said, nigga, this is 2019. <laughs> I hold a grudge over lunch issue? Nigga, please. Nigga, I don't even know you like that. And that's when I called Fred. I said, Fred, I said, hey, man. You see this? I see. I see. Hear this, hear this nigga saying about the reason why I'm coming at him. I said, did you tell him that, uh, that I wanted to go with y'all to lunch? He said, no. Nah. I never said that. I said, when I when I told you that I was going to lunch with him, that was it. I said, exactly. I said, so what this nigga talking about? Yeah. He like, like, what is he saying? He said, I said, he's saying that he, you and him. Uh, he, I got mad because I didn't let he, uh, I didn't he didn't let me go to lunch with you too. He said, nah, bro. He said, he said, man, are you serious? I said, yeah. I said, yeah, nigga, he's saying it on, on, yeah, bro. I said, watch the video. Wow. This nigga. Bro. Watch the video, bro. But dude, man. he just, like I said, going back to that rant, man, he's just whack. He's just telling on himself. Like, yeah, yeah. we ain't worried about my money. Like, nigga, I know you hurt. Yeah, you heard it, bro. bro. His pocket's gotta be bleeding. His pocket's gotta be bleeding. Bro, that was fun. Oh, that was crying. You still got people coming in the driveway, in the parking lot, and collecting offering. Nigga, I know you hurt. You couldn't get your DVD money. Oh, and come on, Jeff already. We talked about that. He always said his little famous saying, "I know when to drop another shoe behind hip hop, when the other DVD sales get low." Yep. So he was already low anyway. Nigga, stop playing. Thank you, player. Your money is running low. That's why I know he. That's why I know nigga was hurt when Part 13. When I when I canceled Part 13, I knew they hit his pocket, nigga. That was six oh, figures yeah, it easily. Oh, the spirit of the thing. Yeah. What's 
my name. <laughs> Come on, everybody already know it. They just want to hear you say it. That's it. Good. Say it. Say it though we can all walk out at the same time. Say it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, trust me. I would have put it more cool. If he had even been dumb enough to say your name, I'd have got up in the middle of the service to walk out. I don't even care. I could have been on I could have been on camera. I'm like, what's wrong? Forget this, forget no, I ain't yeah. there. Let me go, get off me. Get y'all, get y'all niggas. <laughs> y'all deal with it. Yep. yep. Let's go. Yeah, this, this, yeah, this thing is, I mean, I'm trying it, bro. I'm trying to, I, I, I've already gave the video, the, uh, the video to Kirk Franklin and to Erica Camp. I haven't heard anything from them yet. I, I want to give it to the local radio station there, out uh, there in, in Dallas. Yeah. I mean, so it's like, it, it get some traction going to expose this nigga, bro. Because Kirk Franklin, nigga, ain't working with that nigga, bro. I don't know, you know he can top it up. I mean, he, he, he's running off like that during the coronavirus. But, how do you know you're going to see your members again the next day? Right. Or tomorrow, that's not going to nobody. But, right. he contradicted himself even with this, when it's, when the coronavirus started and they were saying the respect, they were like, oh, it's the government plan. They're trying to shut down the church. So the next is. week, the governor was like, well, churches are essential. We'll let you open. What is it not, George? <laughs> I, thought it was the, I thought it was the government plot to stop us from going to church. What is it now, nigga? Hey, hey, yeah, hey, hey, how you going back to me, nigga? Rewind. Give, me, give, me the, give me the soft shoe. Yeah, re re rewind, though, because remember he had said before all this had went down, uh, if they come in here and try to shut us down, I'm going to hold up the Constitution. Then the nigga said that next week, when they, when they, when they, when they, uh, when they find that nigga, they try to sneak into the building. Uh, well, you know, having services at home is not really that bad. You know, yeah. nigga, you just said we could go. Uh, the people who do that, they afraid because they 501c3. Nigga, you ain't 501c3 though. So why are you talking about? Oh, it ain't, it ain't a bad idea to have service. You know, I mean, it's, it's it, it, you know, we all need a break sometimes. Man, I played that tape yeah. back and I compared both of them together. I said, y'all listen to this nigga. I said, y'all hear him. He's a walking yeah. contradiction. Here he goes again. Yep. He, go again. He, can't, he can't keep his story straight. No. He can't. He consistently inconsistent, bro. That's what he is. Yeah. G. Craig Coronavirus Lewis, in one of his quote unquote sermons entitled The Envy of Heaven, dated March 17th, 2020, said this. Hey Amen. Somebody came to the wrong service this morning. They should have went to the service where they, oh, no, they're not having service. That's right. I had a friend of mine, he texted me from Detroit. He was like, man, I can't believe how easy it is for these folks to cancel their services. It's almost like they didn't want to do it. Where's the church? Where's the church? Nowhere to be found because they're 501c3. That's why they can't go to church today. Even though they have a constitutional right to gather, you know it's against the constitution to stop people from gathering. That's why we are here. I'm going to hold up sheet of paper. Remember what y'all said? But as hypocritical and as contradictory as G. Craig Coronavirus Lewis is in his end time prep sermon dated March 31st, 2020, says this. And that's first. We're going to prepare our homes. The church building, which is what this is, is a place of worship and house of prayer. But because many of us do not own our own buildings or land that we're on, we may choose to comply with county, cities, and states that we reside in, uh, compliance to this COVID uh, dilemma and, you know, just empty our buildings out and just allow, you know, our space to be empty and we go online and stream or whatever method the church has, uh, drive through church, outdoor church, whatever they're doing. Uh, because a lot of churches just don't own their land. And uh, that's kind of the, the, the situation we're in. We're leasing in a lease space. And so, you know, with 500 people in a lease space, you pretty much, you know, have to play by the rules or you're going to have 500 people in your house. <laughs> so 
we kind of got to play by the rules a little bit here and, you know, think of the short term for the long term kind of thing. And, you know, I know a lot of people say, well, you got to fight and you fight. But some, you know, every every battle isn't your battle. OK. And um, as I get into this message, I'm going to kind of show you how, you know, the, the, some of these things may not be so bad. It may not be all that bad for people to not have access to their buildings for a short period. And here's uh, and I'm going to get into that. As the end time perils unfold, we must be more reliant upon what we've learned and received in our time of collective gatherings so that we can apply these principles and examples to our own home. So it's pretty much now it's time for you to just, you know, what you learned in the gathering, it's time to gather your family together and teach those things or show those things. And a lot of times when you're caught up in church, you're caught up in titles, you're caught up in positions, you're caught up in working. A lot of times you need a break from that anyway. And a lot of times you can be someone different in church than you are at home. And so now it's time to see who you really are. Spend some time in home, confined to your home with your husband or your wife and your children for a long enough period. You're going to find out exactly who you are. <laughs> I'm not sure why you're laughing, George, because didn't you say in the previous message that you had on, I don't know, uh, the envy of heaven that you're going to hold up the Constitution should the government, should the state, should the local authorities try to shut you guys down? You say you're going to hold up the Constitution. You said that they can't stop you from gathering. So which one is it, George? We're confused. Or maybe you're confused. That's no, a I just fraud, man. How you consistently inconsistent? That's cold-blooded with this film. Yeah. And, and, I'm, and I'm telling you, bro, when I get that DVD, Bruh. Oh yeah, I'm sending it to you tomorrow, oh. man. I'm doing my analyzation, bro. I'm sending that to you tomorrow. I can't uh, wait to get it work, and I can't wait to, for you to hear back from Kurt when he gets his report. Oh, I'm gonna you have out. I'm gonna you have to break. I'm gonna you have to show my face. Just let me do it. Just let me do it for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so uh, what the Lord saying, then I'm gonna let you do you. Yeah. <laughs> you feel tell us what you feeling right now. Damn. <laughs> Reporting live, tell us who knew, nigga. It's real. Let, let me know. Real. Let, let me know. Please. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, well, I oh. I, I, yeah, look, when I when I when I get it, Jerry, when I get it, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a yeah. selfie. I'm gonna do a selfie with the with the DVD cover in my hand. Oh yeah. I'm gonna do a oh, selfie. Oh, yeah. oh, I'm, 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 I'm gonna do a selfie. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna do a selfie and then I'm gonna put a caption. I'm gonna do I'm gonna put a caption under it. Let, let, let me let me see something. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh wait, there's more, George. Don't worry, I'm coming for you. Oh yeah. Like, I got more questions, John. I got more questions. I got more questions, nigga. I got questions, nigga. On the horse shack, nigga. My hands up, nigga. Oh, 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 Mm. And that's why I, I, I was telling them, bro. I'm like, look, you don't, you don't play with, with terrorists, bro. You take them out. This nigga been doing this for 20 years. 20. Time is up. So, hey man, go ahead, hey, hey Jay, go ahead and run that. Go ahead, and run that, that DVD, man. Go ahead, and get the notes and stuff down. I'm gonna let y'all run. I'm about to get out of here and uh and uh right. and finish my day, man. But hey, hey, uh, right, hey Dre, say my number, bro. I got your number saved up as well, too, man. We are gonna connect it later on and uh. And, and Jay, let me know when you mail it off, and I'll be looking for it. All right, man. All right, man. I got it. All right, man. Appreciate y'all, brothers, man. All right, you have a good one. Thank All right, y'all, too, man. All right, man. Peace. All right. Yes, sir.